What's up, guys? T today, wait, let me get some. Today, we're gonna be rating the Harry Potter movies. And when I'm done with the books, we'll rate the books. So, getting on with the uh, first Harry Potter. The Philosopher's Stone, or the Sorcerer's Stone, as um, I think Americans call it more that. Wow, my hair today. Anyways, the movie where it all starts, where Harry is introduced, and his cousins, his aunt, and his, uh, no, he, just one cousin, which the, the aunt and uncle, they love very much. They treat Harry like a piece of, um, not demonetized, hits, no, tis, yeah, tis, tis, yeah, backwards, a piece of tis. In the book, it actually says they give him rags and old clothes of Dudley, the cousin. Dudley's fat as H E. No, no, not H E double hockey six. Hell, he's fat. He's fat like a pig. He's gigantic. He eats whatever he wants. He gets like a hundred presents. Anyways, then the letters start coming in on Sunday. Blah, blah, blah and he gets invited to Hogwarts, and it's like a dream come true magic and stuff and he's so fascinated and he meets weasley and granger malfoy of course and he hates him anyways that movie i'm grading out of 10 uh it was a solid eight not the best because it's just fairly boring at the beginning well, also, the book is fairly boring at the beginning. Well, it's amazing, but um, out of all of them, 8 out of 10. Now, for the second movie, The Chamber of Secrets. Wow, I think, honestly, it's probably the best one here. Um, well, they, they know a little bit bit more about each other, about Malfoy, about, um, you know, about each other, about Hermione, about Ron, they become close friends. They bail him out of a punishment with a flying car, uh, almost get expelled for getting, for almost getting seen with that car, uh, but... But they don't. They don't. Don't. Because the headman, the, no, not the headmaster, the head of Gryffindor saves them. McGonagall, one of my favorite characters. She's so nice. Also, the old lady in Titanic, if you didn't know. I'm not calling her old. Hey, 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 hey. The same the person, yeah, from there. Yeah. Anyways, I there's so much happening. It's like the longest movie. It's very funny. It's very um, entertaining, and uh, it's overall a great movie. Eleven out of ten. That yeah. 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 Moving on to the third one, Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. He finds out about his um, godfather, Sirius Black. They say so many bad things about him. I think it was either in the fourth or third. I'm, I'm taking from the book right now. And, and they explain that he's the one who caused the death of his parents. But actually, he was trying to help them. He was always helping him. 
uh, he loves his his um his godfather very much and vice versa. So uh, yeah, well uh, they bail him out of Atskaman, which is like the greatest prison of all. He also gets a new defense against a dark arts teacher named Professor Lupin, Remus Lupin, and uh, he learns the Patronus charm from him to fight off the Dementors. And yeah. So anyways, he saves his, his, his godfather, protecting him from the Dementors with an immense Patronus charm. And uh, yeah. This movie, uh, not too much happening. <clears throat> uh, I'd grade it a 7 out of 10. Just not generous. This is just normal level. I, I, I'd, I'd probably give it a uh, 7 out of 10.